Hello and welcome to another episode. Today we are right here in Mayersdal Eco Estate touring another grand mansion. My name is Chad Riveros. This is the Private Property Home Shopper Show and the home behind me is without a doubt absolutely incredible. But before we head off though, remember you can find your new home on privateproperty.co.za. Julian, thank you so much for having us here in Maysville Eco Estate. Tell me a bit about yourself and tell me a bit about your company, Allegiance Properties. So Allegiance Properties has been well established in the Maysville area, especially within the Eco Estate for a number of years now. I've seen properties grow from ground zero over here, just selling off vacant plots, and then obviously seeing these monstrosity of homes that have come up within this estate. So it's been a really, really great privilege to see these homes come up. And with the likes of people I've dealt with along the, along the years, it's been so amazing to see such amazing architecture that has come into fruition over the time. Fantastic. So Maysville Eco Estate, we've toured it so often, a lot of the viewers are quite comfortable with what's going on here in Maysville Eco Estate, but what we've missed is talking about it as a area to live in. So give me some of uh, the pluses of living here in Maysville Eco Estate and why a customer who maybe doesn't know about Maysville or is maybe living in one of the other suburbs would want to move here. So the estate upholds the security that, that any individual that would want to be spending this type of money has to offer. It's 24 hour security, it's nestled in 115,000 square meters of land of which only approximately 350 homes are nestled on the, on the ground itself. The reason so little homes are nestled in is because it's ample, uh, ample um, advantages for animals to freely roam within their state. There's over 500 antelope that are in here, wildebeest and giraffe that, uh, that frequently roam amongst the, the green belt and so forth. So the estate itself is very unique, very family orientated, and it's an estate that really upholds the luxury of lifestyle that most buyers want to, want to partake in. It feels incredible and it definitely doesn't feel like we're right here in Joburg either. Yeah, it seems like we're, in a, we, we're at the Kruger sometimes, uh, you know, part of, the, part of the estate. That's what it feels like. But, what, but what's also nice is what we're going to be going through in terms of this property. I mean, I'm sure you, you've, you've noticed this property and you've seen it obviously come to fruition in terms of being on the market. So I'm quite comfortable to present this property to the public and say, look, this is a home that you should be considering. Mm. And I mean, that's what we have today is to talk about this property here behind us. And give me a couple of your favorite features about this property. Well, I love the fact that it's a thousand square meter home. It's on a 1,500 square meter stand plus minus, but also the architecture of what the home can offer. You know, any buyer that's spending this type of money wants to have that street appeal that a house can offer. And this home, I do believe, has it. Um, one of the key aspects of it is it's got, a, it's got a cinema room, it's got six bedrooms, six bathrooms, double garage on either side. And you know, if granny's coming along, it's always nice to know that there is a lift that can accommodate her into her own uh, private bedroom, which is quite nice to have as an added feature. I can't wait to check it out. Julian, Good. thank you so much. Thank I really you. appreciate it. Thank you. Welcome home. And when it comes to real estate, Allegiance Properties deal with people. There we go. As you step into this home, you're greeted by this incredible entry hall with light streaming through the double volume windows. Just above me, down lighting that matches the elegance of this home stunningly. And then just in front of me, there is that elevator that we mentioned in our intro, beautifully positioned and covered in glass so it doesn't obstruct any of the views that Maysville Eco Estate is so well known for. This room is also air conditioned and leads immediately off to both of your double garages and your very own cinema room, which we're gonna be checking out right now. Come with me. The cinema room is exactly what you'd expect from a mansion this size. It's large, has multiple tiers with several comfy reclining chairs and a multi-channel speaker system complete with a huge projector. But what makes this cinema room so incredible has to be the uniquely shaped bulkhead that houses smart LEDs, so you can set the perfect tone for all of your movie nights. Now with the cinema out of the way, remember you don't have to watch all of your movies there because this entry hall with the way it's been designed doubles perfectly as an area you can sit down, relax and watch a couple of movies. There's a grand piano here so you can make this place your own. It's really nice to see homes that allow so many different types of designs and styling options but this is not all because the rest of the home awaits. Let's take a quick walk down these stairs and see where we find ourselves. And here we are finally within the first living area that we come to. Now this living area borders your kitchen, 
above our heads we've got beautiful bulkhead ceiling this carries on throughout the downstairs area with recessed led lighting as well as those speakers that are built in the ceiling that has become a staple of homes here in Maysdale eco state then below our feet we've got these beautiful large white tiles that really open up the space the area itself has got plenty of room for the massive l-shaped couch behind me underfloor heating and then as i said leads directly onto your kitchen and here we are within many people's favorite area of a home and that is the kitchen now this kitchen can only be described in one way and that is ultra modern we've got white enamel countertops that's broken up so nicely with dark brown cabinetry as well as plenty of silver elements and those silver elements I need to mention right here because as you can see this beautiful thing that you might mistake as a chandelier is actually an extractor fan and this is definitely the first time we've seen an extractor fan be modeled into an art piece and just below that extractor fan we've got a glass melee induction cooktop if you don't want to use induction or you can't because of load shedding they've thought of it just to the right of that you've got a stainless steel gas hob with two burners and to its left you've got your chef sink a staple in any home behind me i'm sure you can see it glowing there but we will have it in cutaways take a look at your very own built-in bar full led lighting to display your favorite drinks and then quick access to the garage so if you're moving groceries it's straight into your kitchen and then into your cabinetry talking about cabinetry built into your floor to ceiling cabinetry you've got six melee appliances two warming drawers two ovens a steamer and a microwave so this home is kitted out with a kitchen that would even make a private chef blush but before we go any further let's move off just to our left and see what the scullery has in store for us The scullery is perhaps the nicest we've seen on the show so far. It carries through the ultra minimalist design from the kitchen and it features some more unique bulkheads. There's plenty of counter and cupboard space so you never need to worry about whipping up large meals for all of the glamorous parties you'll be having in this home. There are also two additional sinks and direct access to your courtyard making this the perfect utility space. And what do we do once we've whipped up a meal for our guests that they're gonna be talking about for weeks? Well, we head off to the dining room, come with me. And here we are just around the corner, you find your dining room area. Now this dining room area is incredibly spacious. Enough space in fact for a 10 seater dining room table and then just above the dining room table being a focal point and leading the eyes all the way up to these high ceilings is this incredible Swarovski crystal chandelier. And then on my right hand side is a corner window letting in that little bit of natural light. And right next to your dining room area is your second lounge area. Now this one is absolutely beautiful, spacious and the perfect place to curl up and watch a movie. And the reason I say that is because despite its modern appearance, it is right next to a gas fireplace. This gas fireplace is shared with the first living area we saw earlier. So it's a complete pasture and a really nice feature, but front and center is a massive TV. And that TV is flanked by two windows letting in a lot of natural light, which makes this room work both during the night or during the day. But when you're done watching a movie, you wanna stand up, you wanna break, or even you want a refreshment, just to my right is a bespoke bar area that is gonna cater for all your needs, and that's up next. Just before we move into the bar area, I'd be remiss not to mention just down this hallway, you've got your guest bathroom as well as your downstairs guest bedroom. That guest bedroom comes with its very own ensuite bathroom, all complete with a freestanding bathtub, single vanity and beautiful windows looking out onto the back garden so it is still very private. And then moving a bit forward, we come to my favorite room in the home, and that is right here, your bar area. Now this bar area is perfectly situated right next to a sliding glass door that leads out onto this manicured garden, as well as pool area and wooden deck, but we're leaving that for last. Let's talk about what you get right here. 
Above our heads, we've got those built-in speakers, a fully air-conditioned bar area that I love because of all these massive windows, areas like this can get so hot. No such thing in this home. Just to my left, you'll see a glass auditorium that is currently decked out as a kid's storage area slash playroom. You can do whatever you want. Let your imagination take wild. But what makes this bar area my favorite room in the home, other than, of course, it is beautifully laid out with all the storage space you could ever want? Well, it is because of this right here a fully enclosed and automated coffee bar with its very own warming drawer. Opening up here, you get to put all your snacks and keep them warm while watching movies in your living room area. But closing this, let's walk outside and see what the garden has in store for us. Because this home is built with families in mind. We've got a pool area as well as a massive patch of grass and then hidden just behind these Stunning, stunning landscape garden is your very own private jungle gym and Wendy house. Trust me, your kids are gonna love not only what Maisdal Eco Estate brings, but what this home in particular has. Now we have wrapped up the downstairs area. Let's take a walk off to the entry hall and decide how we're gonna make our way upstairs to the top floor. Come with me. So this home has a beautiful, elegant floating staircase, but why take the staircase when you can take the elevator? So a quick open, and then we press this button right over here. See you upstairs. Here we are swiftly and safely delivered to our upper level where all the bedrooms are located. Now, because of safety, there are two gates located on the upper level. Both of them require just a small push. And here you are. We've seen a lot of homes and this is easily one of the coolest ways to get to your top level. So come with me and let's take a look at what this whole upper level has in store for us because trust me, it is a lot. And here we are standing in the upstairs pajama lounge and this one is specifically quite special. For one, you've got a beautiful curved wall of glass looking out onto your top deck as well as downstairs into your entry wall. It's perfectly positioned between all of the bedrooms upstairs to be a place that you can sit, relax and enjoy a movie without having to go downstairs and sit in the cinema room or one of the lounges. So it's got quite a cozy atmosphere. And what makes it all the better is just behind me you've got a fully kitted out games room, wraparound couch, pool table and foosball table fit in so easily. And then between all the bedrooms, right next to your games room, is your very own fully kitted out gym, which we're gonna start with. Let's take a look. And now with all the living areas out of the way, there are five bedrooms located on this side of the home. Three of them on this wing, and then two of them located on the other wing, one of those two being your master suite. So what I'd like to do is right next to the lift, we're gonna take a look at the first bedroom and work our way counterclockwise all the way until we reach the master suite. Come with me and let's see what sleeping in Mayersdale Eco Estate in a home this fantastic must feel like. Our first stop on this upper level is the office. The massive space has plenty of natural light and carries through the bulkhead ceiling design we've seen throughout this home. The bulkhead houses the central heating system and a few lights which aid in brightening up this room. But with these high windows, the space is bright enough. The rest of the bedrooms have their own flair, with a few unique features and decor, including different accent walls 
and bulkhead designs. But each space has plenty of windows, stunning light features, and ensuite bathrooms. There's nothing more you'd need in a home like this. And here we are finally within the master suite of this incredible home. So this master suite is divided up into a couple of different areas. Behind me, you've got your bed area, spacious, big, airy, everything we've seen before done perfectly right. The area is air conditioned, but just everything above it is your very own private lounge area. Absolutely massive, custom marble field tiles, two windows with a cantilevered roof and windows built into that cantilever, letting in so much natural light, as well as a really cool chandelier. Being almost a centerpiece, you've got your inbuilt speakers and everything else you could want from your own private space. But just off to my right hand side, you've here got your own walk-in closet that's divided into two different areas. Let's show you what this has in store. You have to admit it's pretty cool having your own private kitchen space in your master suite. But that first set of walk-in closets isn't everything because your second set of walk-in closets is right here. And this leads off to your ensuite master bathroom and we're checking that out right now. Now with that beautiful master bedroom wrapped up, the cherry on top has to be that it leads out onto your very own private balcony with an incredible view of the whole estate. But more importantly, it allows you to look down onto your incredible blue pool or stunning manicured grounds, or even come over here and catch a really nice tan. And this unfortunately brings us to the end of this episode. So let's venture back downstairs so we can talk to you about how you can become the next owner of this incredible home right here in Maysdal Eco State. And unfortunately, that brings us to the end of today's episode. So let's recap what we've seen so far. This incredible home offers six bedrooms, six bathrooms, two separate garages, as well as a whole host of other notable features, such as a bespoke bar, a separate gym room, as well as a cinema room and lift, all for 17 million Rand. Now, if you'd like to become the next owner of this incredible home, what I'd like you to do is contact Julian and Hamad from Allegiance Property. And a big thank you goes out to Julian as well as Hamad for allowing us to show you this stunning home and all of its features. What I'd like you guys to do is like, share and subscribe, and please drop all your comments 
comments of what you thought about this incredible home down below in the comment section. And don't forget to hit the notification bell so you never miss an episode of the Private Property Podcast or another episode of the Private Property Home Shopper Show where we tour all these amazing homes. But from myself, Chad Riveros, and the team at the Home Shopper Show, thank you so much. And we'll see you next time right here. Thank you and goodbye.